What is going on, Nipslips? We are back with the Salty Runback series, and I know there's a few new faces out there in my subscriber count, so let me explain a few rules to you about how this Salty Runback series work. First of all, you do a battle. Best two out of three series. You're, you and your opponent get ten Pokemon each. Ten. Ten Pokemon each. Out of those ten Pokemon for game one, you ban two from each side. Where your opponent bans from me and I ban from my opponent. Now, with the remaining eight Pokemon, you make a team of six, and you do a battle. Game 2 comes along, you do the same exact thing, but you bust ban 2 new Pokemon. If you ban Venus or Treasure Game 1, you cannot ban Venus or Treasure for Game 2. Must be 2 completely new Pokemon. And if Game 3 is necessary, you can ban the same Pokemon from Game 1, but not the same from Game 2. However, you should know what your opponent's team likes to do, so by then you should uh, ban and uh, just just play style accordingly. Now, I'm also introducing a brand new rule. As you guys can see, my opponent's team is right down below me. But there is a box on the top, and why is that? We are now introducing Team Captains, baby. Team Captains, what they do. They must be introduced before the other nine Pokemon. Um, now, what do they do? Team Captains cannot be banned, folks. They cannot be banned. That's it. That's it. They, cannot, they cannot be banned whatsoever. So, as you see, guys, see right here, my Kyurem Black is my team captain. My opponent's captain is his Talonflame. Now, this is my team. We had the Kyurem Black, Mega Metagross, uh, the, the Trevenant, uh, Granbull, Tyrantrum, Heatron, Florges, Altaria, Gardevoir, and the Starmie. That is my team right there. My opponent banned my Metagross and my Trevenant. So, what am I going to do? Moves guys off to the side, make a team of six. I'm going to use Kyurem Black. I'm going to use Heatron. I'm going to use Gramble. Florges. Uh, Starmie. And Gardevoir. Unfortunately, he banned two physical attackers this time around. So I'm going to be left out of the loop with the physical attack. I only have two. I only have really one physical attack, which kind of sucks. Makes me want to use Tyrantrum anyway, but I then have three walls on the team. So we only have two. Uh, based off his bands, I only can only use two physical attackers in this game. Which is really, really annoying. That's what we're gonna do. That's what we have to deal with it. We have to deal with it. So this is our team right here, folks. Gardevoir, Starmie, Gramble, Florges, Heatron, and the Kyurem Black. We're gonna see how this fares for us. And we're gonna hope it works out. Uh, it works out for us either way. But uh, let's see what my opponent is gonna be bringing us. We're gonna uh, get into this battle with him right now. Is this him right here? Nope. Where is he at? Where is he at? Where is he at? This is him. Nope. Is this you? No. Oh, here you are, right there. Boom. Battle. To play match on rules, you'll be up. There we go. So we're gonna get this battle right with my man Granite Empire. By the way, Granite Empire has a channel, uh, channel as well. I'm gonna post a link to his channel down below. You guys should check him out. He's probably gonna be. Is if you're going to this, I have no idea. If he does, that'd be freaking awesome. I really appreciate the publicity if he does so. But uh, if not, oh well, we get a free, we get a freaking free battle with a good friend. So let's do this. 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 It's cool. I know you do the team summary at the beginning of your original pro. Okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Alrighty. So we get the battle on the way against my man Granite Empire. Let me. Is it really 61 degrees inside? No way. Is it really 61 degrees? That's so hype. Is it really? There's no way. There's no way it's 61 degrees. Let me see this right now. Uh, it's 58 degrees. Yeah. All right. That's freaking hype. I didn't do that. I already got inside today. Anyway. Let me see my opponent is bringing me today for game one. Battle start. Battle by. I already tell you how I banned. I banned his. It's going to be X out down below uh, in, in the team preview. But today, I'm going to those X out. Those are Pokemon I banned. I banned his Swamper and his Landorus. He banned my Trevident and my... um. Uh, Metagross. So once again, I banned his uh, Swampert and Landotharian. And that's going to be down below. That's why they have access to them right now. So let me see your team right now. You have a Beedrill. Magnet... Um, what the hell you call that thing? The Magnezone, Starmie, Gligar, Talonflame, and Weavile. Who is he going to lead with? I have no idea. I have Rocks and Honda Civic. Uh, I kind of want to lead with you because you have Talonflame. You're probably going to lead with Starmie though. I feel Starmie coming in hot. No one you might go with the Starmie lead. I'm gonna opt with the uh You have Psy Shock though. I'm gonna opt with the Gardevoir. Do you have do you have a thunder move Gardevoir? You have Moonblast. Psy Shock, Energy Ball, Moonblast. So you have Energy Ball. So you're gonna, we're gonna go Gardevoir. And I'm gonna bring in the other guys. Back up with the other guys. Here we go, guys. Game one on the way against my man Granite Empire 4. The return of the Vermax series. I hope you guys enjoy the new layout. I had a fun making it, and I hope you guys uh, have a blast today, man. Hope you guys have a freaking blast. It's gonna be, it's gonna be, I'm, I'm pumped for this. I'm pumped for the return of this to the channel. It's been a while, it's been a quick minute, but we are back. Ready to go against my man, Granite Empire. Let's do it, folks. Let's see if we can get game one under our belt. I apologize for the long intro just because I'm explaining the rules, and uh, it is what it is, folks. It is what it is. And he opted to go with the Beedrill lead. I'm gonna choose the sword, it's completely and utterly useless. Your physical attack, I can't even go with the Gramble because you get through Gramble easily. You might protect here if you don't. I'm gonna go Psy Shock and probably Oko you. Let's do that. 
Let's see what you, let's see what you got. He's gonna make about this. He have protect. Does he have drill run? Does he? I mean, does he have a protect drill run? Uh, you turn and uh, the uh, poison jab, or is he gonna have something else? And then he goes right for protect. All right, you got your protect up. And the question is, do I want to go for side shock again? Reveal my choice scarf, or do I want to switch? I'm gonna I'm gonna stay and go for choice uh, side shock right here. Right here, baby. Right here, baby. Can I get it? Can I get it? I think I might. I think I freaking might, man. I think I might. I really think I might. He doesn't know. He's thinking, though. He's thinking about it. He's thinking if I have choice scarf enough or not. He is thinking. This would be a huge KO if I could get it. I think he's going to get O-Code. I'm almost positive. The difference is so low. I'm pretty sure you get O-Code. Looking at team, you could go into Gligar, your Starmie, your Weavile, even. So you have options right now. You have options. I'm basically revealing my choice scarf off the bat, too. He withdraws. He did it. He made the smart play. comes to Weavile. Weavile comes in, ready to go. I'm going to be forced to switch out into my Gramble. Lower this thing to tech. Doesn't affect the Weavile. All right, that's fine by me. Bring back Gard Gardevoir. Going to my big Bertha the Gramble. Bertha coming out hot, baby. I freaking love Gramble, yo. Such a freaking like unique Pokemon. It has Heal Bell, T-Wave, uh, Play Rough, and EQ. That's beautiful coverage, in my opinion. Fairy and Granite type. And it's not the best, don't get me wrong, but it's a... Uh, not bad either. It's pretty hard. Uh, decent attack and HP stats. Not the best uh, bulk, but he's intimidate. That's the key thing. He's intimidate to um, to uh, get around things like uh, his physical attack or that he walls. And he's just freaking solid. He's solid all around. Look at this. He's going to do like, nothing. Look at that. Freaking look at that. And he's Life Orb. Okay, Life Orb Weavile. Fine by me. You may not let your Pokemon team. You have a Gligar. Okay, avoid T-Wave. You're probably going to go into him right now. Which makes me want to go into my... I have no ice moves in my uh, my Lando. I mean, my Kyurem. I opted I opt to go for Substitute over Ice Beam. Should have brought Ice Beam, though. It's alright. I could go into my... I think it's Ground Flying. I have Starmie I could go into. I'm going to go into Starmie here, but then you go into the Gligar. I'm doing it. He was yours. Weavile, who's coming in? Is it going to be that Gligar? Is it going to be the Evil out of Gligar? Oh, it is, baby. It freaking is. Good play right here. Going to double switch. Go into my Starmie. Put you in a situation because I have Scald, Psy Shock, and um, Rapid Spin plus one more. What do I have? Ice Beam. I have Ice Beam right here. I'm going to go Ice Beam. So I have Ice Beam with Scald. I want to go Ice Beam. You could go right back into your Starmie. Either way, it's free damage. Let's uh, you know, let's go Scald. You're going to go to Magnezone or something. Let's go Scald. Or are you going to stay in? Are you going to stay in? If you stay in, you got me so good if you stay in. You got me so good if you stay in. My beautiful Starmie looking cute right now. I gotta put in the work. I missed my T. Missed my T. Ready to go, folks. Ready to freaking go. Can we Can we do this? That'd be phenomenal if we could. That'd be phenomenal if we get this kill right here. Is he gonna stay? I don't know what he's gonna do. I feel like he might stay in. I feel like he might stay in. So far, my predictions are on point, but that, that doesn't mean I'm gonna like be successful in the turn. For this turn, I mean, at least. I really, I really want you going to Magnezone Zone or someone else. He stayed in. Shoot! Should have got an Ice Beam. Should have got an Ice Beam. It's fine though. It's fine. Get the burn. You know, for that U turn, you're gonna break my sash. I should have got an Ice Beam. Should have got an Ice Beam. Who's coming in now? Is it gonna be the Magnezone? Zone? My sash is gone. So I don't have to worry about uh, working around that anymore. Took some damage for no reason. Got some good damage off on this Gligar though. Don't get that. Don't get me wrong. We did it. That was a good turn. Got some huge damage off either way. Could have got the KO with the Ice Beam, but I refused to go for that one for Scald. Put it in a Magnezone or a fellow Starmie to come in. Now he's going to bring in his Beedrill. He's going to have his U-turn up and ready to go. Uh, I don't want to deal with that at all. Kind of going to Bertha here. But the U-turn is so real. We can just go to the Honda Civic. Never mind. You go Heat Run. You go Heat Run all day. Avoid that Poison Jab. Avoid that uh, U-turn severe damage. It would be, be in good shape, actually, if you go to the Heat Run. We're going right to the Heat Run. Heat Run it is, folks. Heat Run it is. Hope the bootcamp is not a little awkward for you guys. It is a little bit smaller because I had to fix the uh, 10 boxes in. But I think we should be good to go. I think we're golden. I think we're golden. We bring it out the Heatron, the Honda Civic, ready to freaking go. The beautiful Pokemon. If I do say so myself, Poison does not affect me. Beautiful. Freaking beautiful. Yes. Now. Do you have any spinners in your team? You have Starmie. Shoot. I don't even want to go for Stealth Rocks. Then. You're going to go into Starmie here. You're guaranteed to go into Starmie. You're going to U turn into Starmie, aren't you? Uh, I might as well put my rocks up and force you to rapid spin. We oh, is drill run. No, that's it. That's it for Heatron. That's it. That is it for Heatron. Son of a mother. That was a crit too. 
I always forget he has drill run. Shoot. I always, I, even though I just said it too earlier. Son of a biscuit, man. That is going to cost me a lot right there. Losing that heat try special wall for no friggin' reason. Because just your adaptability, which is freaking huge on Gardevoir now. Choice of Gardevoir nonetheless. I can opt in for Psyshock, or I could go for Moonblast, put it in a uh, Weaver. I'm gonna go Moonblast. I'm going Moonblast. You're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna. Ooh, Weaver for Protect! And I'm for Moonblast. Sugar, 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 sugar. Kinda wanna stay in, but there's no reason not to. There's no reason to stay in, I mean. I'm in, I'm in such bad shape. I'm in such bad shape. I am in such bad shape. I am in such, even if he goes, for, even if I go to Gramble, uh, it just sucks. It just sucks all around. I have to go Gramble. I have to go Gramble. I have to waste him. I have to waste him. I mean, he might live. He might live, but he probably, but the if he intimidate, adaptability, and poison jab. I don't know. I have to go Birthday. I have to do it. Get the intimidate off on the B drill, and now is a poison jab. Can I live it? Can I live it? If the intimidate. We living. We are living, folks. We are living. Now. I'm going to die to another poison jet, which is fine. I'm just going to offer the play rough. No, I'm going to go for T-Wave, just in case you lose something zesty. Just in case. Poison jet goes off. Oh, that's going to be the end. That's going to be the end of the, of the, uh, of the Bertha. Oh, of the Bertha. The bad thing that outspeeds you is that Gardevoir. Gardevoir is my only answer for this thing right now. I could go into my, I could go into my, uh, I could go into my uh, Kai, uh, Caillou Rem. But what is he going to do for me if I do that? What is he going to do for me if I do that? I could get a sub wall. I'm going to go Caillou Rem here. This is my chance to go Caillou Rem. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it, folks. Get that sub off. You have Drill Run, which is kind of good against Ice type. Are you going to stay in, though? Will you stay in? I, don't think, I can't see you staying in. I'm going to go for a sub here. I don't see you standing. You switch out. Don't, I don't care about your run. Switch out. Switch out. Please switch out. Please, for the for the sake of my uh, well-being, switch out. Just do it. Look at that. Look at that stance. That B drill and the freaking Kyrie. Just standing down, ready to go, yo. Ready to freaking go. Now I really, really, really want you to switch out. I, I I need you to switch out. Otherwise, I'm in bad shape. You have drill run. Uh, I know you have drill run. I know you have it. It's gonna do a big amount, but you are intimidated. So I think that makes you want to switch out into your. Uh, not your Gligar, but something like Starmie or Magazine even? I don't even know. He goes to the U-turn. How much is that going to do to me? Not that much. Not that much, right? Is that another crate? Of course it is! That's it. This game is completely over now. 100% over. 100% over. That crate was so unbelievable. un freaking believable We're going to get a sub off at like 0 HP now. I can't believe that I can't believe that crit just happened. I really can't believe that crit just happened. How much that made the whole entire game change. I really cannot believe that at all. I'm just gonna declaw. I'm just gonna declaw. I don't outspeed you. Don't think I outspeed you. You guys, I definitely don't outspeed you. There's no way I do. There's no way I do. Shash goes off. He's gonna break my he's gonna break my uh maybe a life orb. There goes my sub. Can you not be life orb? I mean can you not be sash? Be Yes, you're not sash. Beautiful. Here comes the Drake decoy. This could kill. This could kill. It's not going to. Sugar! We lost. 100% lost. 100% lost, man. That would have that been a completely different game if that crit didn't happen. Completely different game. Here for Psy Shock. I'm assuming this thing dropped. There's no reason for it. There's no reason for it. Can he miss? Nope, he's not going to miss. And that's going to be the end of Kyrie and Black. That's it right there. That is it, folks. That is it. Shoot. And he's going to live with the life for me. Shoot! Shoot, shoot. I can't bring this back. I have three, uh... Three pokes to his six. Uh, I'm just going to bring up Blind Shot the Gardevoir. And I'm going to go for... Uh, you're not going to switch this thing out. I'm going to trace your abuses analytic. And now I'm going to... I guess... Moonblast? No, because you have you have the uh I'm a Moonblast. Why not? Doesn't matter, you're not gonna switch out. You're not gonna switch out. Oh you do switch out, see? Fluff! I'll take it. This is gonna be this is gonna be a dead weaver, I believe. I mean a dead weaver, a dead Gligar, I believe. Moonblast goes off. 
He sack up the Gligar. He's gonna save the other people. All right, it's fine by me. I don't know if that crit mattered. Highly doubt it did. Highly doubt it did. Highly doubt it did. Ah oh, man, here comes Beedrill. Now I'm locked in the Moonblast. He can just go for a free attack. He's my only answer for you. 100% lost this game. 100% lost this game. Uh, all right, I guess. Do I let Gordon Boy drop? Do I let Gordon Boy drop and get a free, free Moon Blast off? Nope. Let that. Uh, let Starmie drop. Let's just let Starmie drop. It's fine. Shoot, shoot, friggin' shoot. Sorry for such potential, too. Sorry for such potential. And then it all went downhill. All went downhill, especially with the freaking crit on Kyura, man. That sucks so bad. Ugh. All right, I'm going to bring you out. Going to bring out the Gardevoir and just go for the... Go for the Psy Shock. I, this just sucks so bad. I get adaptability. I want to go Psy Shock and kill you. I know you're going to protect. I know for a fact you're going to protect. I might as well Psy Shock. He withdrew. I almost went Moonblast! Chris, you're gonna protect again. He's gonna sacrifice Starmie off. That's fine by me. Sacrifice to Starmie. It's gonna be dead. Dead and that goes to Starmie. Now he has to go Weavile. He has to go Weavile, and I have to go into my Ratadactyl, my Florages, and that's it. He wins right there because he's gonna Oko that. With uh, Weavile does get Poison Jab, I believe. I think mine. Has, oh, he was in the Magda Zone. Yeah, I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna go into my uh, my uh, Florages here anyway. Shoot, man! Freaking shoot! If I could like find a way to kill Weavile, I could and this thing right here, I could sweep with Psy Shock, I believe. Cause you have a dead Gligar, dead Starmie, and a dead I don't even know what what hit me. Hidden power. Alright. Are you kidding me? I didn't think it really mattered, but I had to do this anyway. I had to do this anyway. Can I be I can I speed you? No, I can't. Flash kinda goes off, it's gonna be a dead forages, and that's gonna be game one. Game one I'm going to my man Greta Empire over here. I gotta reevaluate. I need to reevaluate my uh, whole entire decision here. Whole entire decision here. Game two, I'm definitely gonna ban. I'm not even gonna ban B drill. I'm gonna ban. I mean, I have to deal with Lando now. Shoot, I don't even know. I gotta figure this out. I gotta figure it out. He can't switch. He's locked into this thing. Doesn't even matter. Uh, I'm just gonna forfeit and not waste the time. This is gonna be the battle right here. So it's gonna be game one. Game one, go back to my man, Grand Empire. Coming back for game two real quick, guys. So get ready. Get ready for game two. Got a new Pokemon. Get new uh, new shenanigans going on. So I'll see you guys for then. Thank you for watching. As always, you're beautiful, wonderful, amazing audience. And I'll see you guys soon. Have a spectacular day. And get puffed for game two because we'll be back with that very shortly. See you later, guys.